Today is September 22nd, 2012, and it's around the time of the equinox in Colorado, 8.49 a.m. I'm starting here at my north-facing garden in zone one of my three-acre home site. And this is, I'm starting here because this tree reminds me of my permaculture design course certificate that I got on the north shore of Oahu. So anyway, let's go to the north facing garden that I love so much and let's look at the plants. Here's a peace rose. There's a bunch of roses here, a Don Juan rose, an Abe Lincoln rose, orange roses, white roses, <clears throat> cosmos, an annual, and also some mums of different colors. And there's that beautiful yellow annual, I forgot its name, but it's a great annual. Um, anyway, here's the black-eyed Susan that helps create the microclimates for my north-facing garden. And also, what I really love is that because of the microclimates, I have Iceland poppy from the spring through right now. There you can see that pink flower that still is here despite the fact that usually they can only make it through the spring. I love this Iceland poppy. It just reminds me of how great permaculture is and how we can use microclimates to do a lot more than what we could do without them. Now there's some dynamic accumulators here such as lemon balm. Lemon balm is a wonderful dynamic accumulator just like marigold. You know, so we can do more with dynamic accumulators in our garden besides comfrey. There's some cosmos. And the vinca vines are my living mulch that creates this, the uh, mulch for this area to help everything thrive the way it does. So let's look at the peace rose again. Isn't that beautiful? Here's the Don Juan rose along with St. Francis. <clears throat> and some orange roses that I got for Mother's Day a Blinken rose, a Mexican cone flower, which is a lot like um, the black-eyed Susan, but my favorite is the Columbine, the state flower of Colorado, together with a climbing vine, the clematis. How beautiful. And there you can see the uh, vinca flowering. Again, this is Angelica. So there's more here that I haven't said, but it's so beautiful. I love it. Enjoy the equinox and share this beautiful garden with me. It's where I get a lot of transplants to take all over the place. So Pueblo West, North Facing Garden. Enjoy.